Hey guys, it's Victoria and welcome to today's video. So this one is just going to be a quick get ready with me to film because I have to pump out four videos today so that I can have them all pre-filmed for my trip in June, which actually they might all be up before this one, but I don't know. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. So I'm gonna be doing a pretty simple look today, nothing too crazy. Um, I think I'm going to start with my Tarte Shape Tape in Light Neutral. As you can tell, I am very, very pale right now. But we're just gonna put it underneath our eyes. And put it in. So I'm gonna take this little beauty blender and just pat it in. What I love about the Tarte Shape Tape is that it really just covers up your under eye circles and it's really just fabulous. So this trip that I'm going on and I should be on when you're seeing this, actually I think you'll be seeing this on June 21st so I will be coming back as you're seeing this and yeah so pretty much all the videos for up until June 21st are going to be pre-filmed because I will be gone for a couple weeks and I won't be able to film. So that's why I'm just working pretty hard to get these out right now so that we don't have to worry about trying to get them out later on. So as always, I'm going to bake under my eyes just to make them a little brighter. And this concealer is a little too dark for me right now. Which is sad because this concealer is really light. So, yeah, I'm excited for my trip. My lovely parents are letting me go. It was a little scary because of the If you weren't sure how it was going to work out. But I'm able to go, which is awesome. I don't know if your states are still in quarantine by the time this video is up. I believe my state's supposed to be opening up on um, June 1st, but I'm not quite for sure because it's been supposed to open up multiple times before, so you just don't really know. I'm hoping we'll be opened up soon though because I am really tired of this. I understand, yes, it's for everyone's safety, it's for something good, but I just am tired of being in this house. So I'm taking my Ulta bronzer and just putting this on my cheeks to try to make me look a little tanner, especially in this very bright light. I kind of look like a freak right now. I'm a little scared of myself, if I'm being honest. I'm gonna put it on my cheeks. Try to blend it in. We're gonna put some on my forehead, just because it'll look better on the camera as well. And then, we're actually going to take the same bronzer with the same brush because I didn't bring out another brush and we're just going to put this on my eyelid just for a little moment. There's literally powder going everywhere from that. Now I'm going to do my eyebrows and I'm going to use my Goof Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit now because I am pretty much out of my other one. So we're going to go back to this one, try it out. I didn't bring a spoolie out here because I forgot. So we're just gonna have to try to, I swear to God, if I can't do my eyebrows, I'm gonna have a mental breakdown. It literally was just working the other day. So this has been broken since I got it. It's literally right there, oh my gosh. What am I gonna do? My eyebrows need eyebrowed. I could use that bronzer, but I don't have a brush to put it on. Eventually, my makeup stuff is gonna be out here, but I am using like my everyday stuff, which stays in my room. And I don't have a whole lot of makeup right now, so I don't have everything out here. But when I like have more makeup, it will be out here, but <laughs> I don't have makeup right now. Rub this in there and then go. Maybe? I might have just done something, so I'm gonna rub this in here. You gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I don't wanna go back inside to get anything else. It's not necessarily the right color, 
but are we gonna make it work? Yes, we are. Welcome to Tori's Ratchet Salon. They look a little funky, but I think it's actually working. So, um, I'm like low-key a genius. Oh, also, when do you guys get out of school? I know this is like way after you guys will be out of school, but I just wanna know like when did you get out of school? Cause I finished May 8th and we're using like the last week like until the 15th, just for like people that haven't been doing their stuff to like catch up. But since I do my stuff every day, I will be done May 8th. And I don't think we're taking any finals or anything. Yeah, also, what are you guys doing for your graduations? And are you rescheduling prom? I know Town Next was is rescheduling prom to like July like 15th or something like that. But obviously that's going to get canceled. But, um... I don't know. As far as I know, we haven't rescheduled ours yet. I think we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do, but it's not official, officially rescheduled yet. This is how the brows turned out. They're a little ratchet, but it's fine because you're only gonna see me from this far away. And I just brushed off my bake so I can do my mascara. Y'all already know, this is the Maybelline, the Rocket, waterproof, of course. And when I am telling you guys that this crap is waterproof, it is waterproof, okay? Like, she's not going anywhere. Like, I can literally sob, and unless I, like, rub my eyes uncontrollably, it doesn't come off. I highly recommend this one because it makes your lashes look good, because I don't have eyelashes at all, and this actually gives me eyelashes. So, I definitely recommend. I look weird but it's fine now i'm going to take my jeffree star x morphe lip gloss this is first impressions it's just clear i love me a clear gloss and this one doesn't get sticky which i really like i see so many girls rock a clear gloss and it looks so good on them Especially girls with like bigger, like fuller lips. I don't have lips, so uh, doesn't always look the best on me. But you know, it's fine. I'm not a huge lipstick person, so a clear lip gloss is just adds a little something, but it's not like too much. I'm not gonna do anything with my hair because it's in an absolute huge not but i'm gonna change my shirt for the next three videos that i have to film because i remember to bring shirts out here this time i also need to make sure that i have all the videos that i'm filming completely set up ready to go so i can do that but now i'm going to change my shirt really quick here's the shirt i'm wearing right now it's from old navy it says heat wave on it it's an extra large because i wanted it to be really long on me so yeah, this is the shirt now, and here is it after. This is a cropped sweatshirt from Shein. It just looks like this. I never wear this because it's like super duper cropped, but I'm wearing it right now because you can't see my waist anyway. But okay, so that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday, and you don't want to miss one. So yeah, I will see you in the next video.